into your restorative rest practice. Today's practice is focused on yoga for your sore muscles. So if you may have been going a little bit hard here in this new season of beginning, and um, for some people, uh, perhaps making resolutions, <laughs> maybe you're sticking to them, or maybe you just need to, you're feeling sore from sitting, a um, little stiff uh, in your body. This is a great way to bring some energy and uh, blood throughout the body systems. So let's begin with the eyes closed. We'll warm up the hands. Rubbing the hands back and forth together. Inhaling into the nose. Exhaling out the mouth. Grounded in the sit bones. Close the eyes here. And on the exhale, take the warmth of the hands and place them over the eyes. Shifting the weight back and forth. deep into the nose. Exhale, fully out the mouth. Release the shoulders. Really familiarizing yourself with this warmth, feeling the calm of your own hands over your eyes. Full deep breath here. Just setting an intention today for your practice of allowing the breath and the energy to flow to anywhere in the body that needs some extra healing and release. When we're inhaling through the nose here, we'll complete exhale, this time sighing out the mouth. Release the hands, opening the palms up towards the sky. Beautiful. Interlacing the fingers in front of the chest, and we'll just give the hands a nice massage, squeeze the palms, and at the same time, you know, get a few little cracks in the fingers and the wrists. Switch direction, which feels a little strange to move in a non-familiar pattern <laughs> and then release the palms forward rotating the shoulders up and down and back pressing the palms forward chin down towards the chest releasing the back of the neck on the exhale inhale the chin up towards the sky press the palms forward Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, chin up. Exhaling the chin down. Fantastic. Opening up the arms, placing the palms on top of the shoulders. We're going to rotate the shoulders together. So inhale, elbows squeeze together. Exhale, open the knees. Squeeze the back of the body together. Inhale. Shoulders together. Exhale, release. Inhale, squeeze. Exhale, open. One more. Squeezing. Making circles with the elbows as if you're yawning. Bring the elbows together. Head comes down, elbows towards the belly button. Squeeze the palms together, the back of the arms together, the hands together, and then inhale, open the arms up in the opposite direction. Inhale, really keep the shoulders feeling the snap, crackle, pop that's happening in the shoulders and the elbows. Really see if you can find the deepest breath of your day. Allowing for fluid movement, gentle movement, sweet, complete movement. 
Okay. Beautiful. Close the eyes, hands back to the heart. Breathe in through the nose. Exhale. Placing hands on the knees. We're going to begin to do some moves, circling around the spine. If you like, you can open up the eyes, we're pressing the palms into the tops of the thighs, the knees. Slow circles to begin with in one direction. Really releasing through any parts of the hips, the lower back, the shoulders, the feel tension. Inhale, chin parallel to the floor. Exhale, releasing as you move around. I feel like you need a little bit more to grab a fold up the top of the shins, the top of the ankles here. Stabilize the legs. Inhale back. Exhale, move the chest forward. Noticing any snap, crackle, pops, breathing. You might close the eyes. Initiating this movement from the belly first. I'm taking your time as if you're churning butter as we move the digestive organs around and then switch directions. Pressing the inner organ as you move back and around. Slow moving through the body. So we this fine. Let's take your time. Beautiful. Inhale, the arms forward, walking the fingertips forward here. Releasing the hands all the way forward. Head comes down towards the floor. Breathe into the lower back. And then pressing both of the opposite bones into the ground. And then you can sway back and forth from one hip to another, allowing the sway movement to move up through the shoulders, through the head, through the neck. Stay with your awareness. Internally, crossing the palms into the road. Internally, focus with the movement. Just allowing yourself to release here through the head, neck, and shoulder, whatever feels good. Stillness feels good, remaining, remaining in stillness, or if you like, releasing and letting go. In the head, nothing changes. Moving to the back of the heart here. Release the breath up and out. Walking the hands up. Push my back up to sitting. Hold the front body, front body onto the floor. Sphinx underneath, elbows underneath the shoulders, pressing the tops of the hands into the floor. Inhale, bending the right knee. You might be able to reach back and grab a hold of shin, calf or top of the foot, right hand to the top of the right foot. If it feels good to you, instead of uh, allow yourself to sink into the left front shoulder, we'll take the shoulder up and down and back, pressing that whole forearm into the ground, 
looking over the right shoulder. Breathe into the belly here. Looking back at that right knee. Releasing the belly with the breath. Releasing the leg, coming back to neutral. Right elbow comes down, palm of the hand, rotate the shoulder up and down and back, bending left knee. Reach back to the left. Chin, calf, or perhaps hooking left hand on top of left foot. And when you're ready, gaze comes over left shoulder. Releasing the lower back on the left side here. Inhale fully into the belly. That's how deep we can. Right, inhale in through the nose if that feels good. Exhaling out the mouth for the extra release. Or if you like, releasing out of the nose. When you're ready, releasing the leg down. Beautiful. Inhale. Toes together, knees apart, walking the hands back the child's pose. Forehead on the ground. Deep breath into the belly. Um, just press into the ground. Breathe into the belly. Using the breath to give the body permission the mind permission to slow down. Okay, walking the hands up. And then drawing the left leg forward. Into pigeon pose. Right top of the foot onto the ground. Breathe into that left leg. Rotate your shoulders up and down. Beautiful, strong, powerful breath. And if it feels good, releasing forearms up, perhaps the forehead down to the ground. Breathe into the back of the neck, releasing. Allowing that breath again to consciously travel to anywhere in the body that you say. Releasing the breath out of the mouth. Full body breath into that left hip. On the exhale, release, locking the hands up. Tucking the right toe under, drawing the left leg back, right knee comes forward between the hands, right side pigeon. Maybe we send that right hip down. You might even place something underneath this right hip. Left top of the foot into the ground. Inhale, rotating the shoulders up and down, back. You can take some shoulder circles, one direction, other to release. And then when you're ready, releasing forearms, forehead to the back. Palms extended. Finding your release in this pose. Letting go. I'm just fully. Breathe into that right foot. One last final deep, walking the hands back up. 
drawing the right leg up to make the left. I'm going to come on to the back for our final yoga nidra. <sighs> the best part of any restorative class is the line down part. So align the palms to come up towards the sky. Releasing the shoulders, feet hip width distance apart. Allow the shoulder blades to kiss on the back side. Really align the heart to come up towards the ceiling, palms face up. Deepest breath of the day, inhale in through the nose. Exhale, see if you can let all the breath out of the mouth, out of the body. Slow, full exhalation like you're letting the air out of the tire. One more breath like that. Taking as long as you need on the inhalation. Full, complete breath. And on the exhalation, allowing that peace to wash over the body fully and completely. Exhale, release. Make sure that you're warm enough, comfortable in this position. We really try to stay as fully still and relaxed as possible. Allow your eyes to close and keep them closed until the practice has ended. Try not to concentrate too intensely on anything that I'm saying. If the mind begins to wander, just allow it to wander. And if possible, bring it back to the sound of my voice. Taking a deep inhalation in, becoming aware of any sounds that you can hear in this. Nothing else but what you can hear without strain. Begin to focus on the most distant sounds that you can hear. Letting the sense of your hearing radiate out to the furthest part or furthest sound outside of this room, your room, outside of the building, and then bringing your attention back into the space where you are. even closer to your body and then bringing your attention back to the sound of your breath. As it enters out of the body. Now visualize your body with your eyes closed, the room that you're in, Visualizing the entire body, your clothes, your hair, your face. Become very aware of the physical body lying on the floor. Now become aware of the breath. Become aware of the natural, spontaneous flow of the breath without efforting. Just notice the natural breath as it flows in and out of the body, perhaps in through the nostrils and out the mouth. Noticing the feeling of the breath as it moves in and out of the body. The coolness of the breath as you inhale. Following 
the breath cool as it enters the nose, back of the throat, down into the lungs. And then notice the warmth of the breath as you exhale, that warmth. on the upper lip. The natural breath flowing through both nostrils during the inhale and the exhale. See if you can allow the breath to become even slower even longer on the inhalation, even fuller. Notice and allowing the breath to release on the exhalation. Slow, steady breath. Take a long, slow inhalation in. Followed by a lower exhalation. Be able to make your exhale so slow that you notice those after the exhalation. Slow inhalation and even slower exhalation with the pulse. Feel the urge to breathe as it bubbles up like a well inside of you. And, and slowly releasing the breath. Long, slow inhalation, longer, slower exhalation. Perhaps even a pause as you continue to breathe after the breath leaves the body. And then now as the breath enters the body, the breath reaches its fullness. Perhaps another pause. Now we set our intention or send kalpa, a short statement of resolve, positive language. This intention that you set is like a seed planted in fertile soil. To bring about healing and transformation to the body. If you need a statement, you can use, repeat to yourself as silently three times. I am practicing yoga nidra. I am awake, relaxed. I am practicing yoga nidra. I am awake and relaxed. I am awake and relaxed. We will now begin a systematic journey of sensory awareness using inner sense to scan 
the mind throughout different parts of the body. As you hear them name, please, eyes closed, silently repeat the part of the name to yourself. Feeling, sensing that part of the body from the inside, but no need to move it. The practice begins on the right side. Right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe, left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, left big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Now move to the back of the body, right heel, left heel, right calf, left calf, Right buttocks, left buttocks, lower back, left lower back, middle back, up the entire spine, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, back, back of the neck, head. Now move to the front of the body. Begin at the top of the head, forehead, right temple, left temple, Right ear, left ear, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, middle of the brow. Right eye, right cheek, left cheek, chin, jaw, throat. Right collarbone, left collarbone, right side of the chest, left side of the chest. Upper abdomen, navel, lower abdomen, right groin, left groin, the pelvic floor. The whole right leg, the whole left leg, the whole right arm, the whole left arm, the face, the head, the whole torso, the whole body, the whole body. Moving to progressive muscle relaxation, bringing your awareness back into your body. I will ask you to relax every muscle in your body by squeezing the part and then releasing it. Here you can begin to wiggle your fingers and your toes. And focus on groups of muscles. Taking a breath. We start now, take your awareness to your feet, toes, calves, shins, and knees. And your next inhale, begin to flex, contract, engage your feet, toes, calves, shins, knees. The top of your breath, squeeze, 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 keep flexing, squeeze a little more, pause, and then release, exhale. 
Let those parts of the body relax. Now take a few deep breaths in between. Allow your awareness to move to the next set of the body. Bring your attention and squeeze the thighs, quads, hamstrings, glutes, lower abdomen. On the inhale, begin to flex, contract, engage those parts of the body. Top of the breath, keep squeezing, squeezing, keep flexing, squeeze a little bit more. And on the exhale, release. Let all those parts of the body relax. Now take a few deep breaths in between. Next, engage your abdomen, shoulders, spine, torso. Inhale, flex, flex, engage. At the top of your breath, squeeze, keep flexing. Squeeze a little bit more, pause, and then release. Exhale, releasing those parts of the body. <sighs> Take a deep breath in between. Now onto your arms, shoulders, hands. Begin to flex, contract, engage them. Create a tight fist with the hands. Flex your fingers at the top of your breath. Keep squeezing, keep flexing. Squeeze a little bit more. Pause. Release, exhale. Let those parts of the body relax and let go. Now on to the head, the scalp, the ears, the eyes, the face. On your inhale, begin to flex, squeeze. All the muscles in the face contract. Tighter. Engage. At the top of your breath, squeeze a little more, pause. And release everything with an exhalation. <sighs> Releasing the whole body. Allowing the whole body to be fully relaxed. Yet still and aware. Coming back to the natural cadence of So next, focus on the chitakash or the space in front of your eyes with your eyes closed. Imagine as if you're seeing a transparent screen, a movie theater. The screen is as high and as wide as you can see. And concentrate on this mind screen, becoming aware of any images, color, phenomena, light patterns that manifest. Continue your awareness on this space. Aware, but still detached in awareness. Not involved. If any subtle images make themselves known, simply direct yourself back to the center space. If thoughts occur, just letting them come and go. Detach and yet aware. On this empty screen, in your favorite color, placing your Sankalpa. I am aware and I am relaxed. Again, painting with an imaginary paintbrush onto the screen. An image perhaps that represents this intention, this positive intention for yourself. I am aware, I am relaxed.
And one more time, repeating silently to yourself. I am aware. I am relaxed. Allowing that awareness to move throughout the body. Start to listen to the external sounds in the room and the building. We begin to exhale, extend the arms, wiggle the fingers again. Bringing yourself back to that image of your body in the room. You're in, your clothes, your hair, your face, the body lying relaxed on the floor. Where your body connects with the surface you're lying on. Using that awareness, you bring the sounds of the room closer to you, closer to the sound of your breath. And when you're ready, rolling on the right side, if you'd like, if you have the luxury to stay resting, like your gaze off into dreamland and fall asleep. But if you need to come back into the body, rolling onto the right side and then gently at your own pace, coming back to sitting. Palms in front of the heart. Thumbs pressed into the center of the chest. Chin bowing down in gratitude to the center of your heart. For the reset, this restorative practice, giving thanks to yourself for showing up for this healing today, to your strong and able body, your capable and aware mind. Namaste, Nanashi. Give thanks. If you found any benefits from this practice, please feel free to like, share, subscribe. Namaste. See you next time.